top styles rallied from its four-year low after reporting a return to underlying sales growth. The tile retailer, which has been dragged down by a fall in consumer confidence and changes to stamp duty, said sales had picked up in the eight weeks since the end of its financial year in September, increasing 3.2 percent compared to a 0.3 percent fall the year before. The news encouraged investors and helped soften the blow of its weak full-year results. Top Styles reported a 2.9% fall in same-store sales in the year to the end of September, while profits dived 15% to pound 17 million. Sales across the group slumped 1.5% to £211.8 million. Matthew Williams, chief executive, said, The business responded well to the more challenging trading conditions we experienced in 2017. While we are retaining our prudent view of market conditions for the year ahead, we are encouraged by this return to like-for-like -like sales growth. Shares rose 7%, or 4.25p, to 65p shares in Convitec dropped 2.5%, or 4.8p, to 190p as investors braced themselves for its exit from the FTSE 100. The medical products firm is set to exit the Blue Chip Index, alongside theme park operator Merlin and engineer Babcock. Takeaway company Just Eat, packaging firm DS Smith & Products producer Halma are set to be promoted in the final FTSE reshuffle of 2017 today. The FTSE 100 finished up 1%, or 76.75 points to 7460.65. While the FTSE 250 finished up 0.7%, or 144.93 points to 20,026.19 points. Meat producer Cranswick soared after beefing up its half year sales and profits. The business said sales jumped 23% to £714.6 pound million in the six months to the end of September, up from £580.8 pound million the year before. Profits increased 9.9% to £44.5 million. IT have also revealed plans to invest in a £54 million poultry factory in Suffolk, sending shares up 8.6%, or 259p, to 3,276p. Cybersecurity firm Sophos slumped 6%, or 39p, to 607p as its largest shareholder, Apex Global Alpha, sold down almost half of its stake. The private equity firm, which invested in Sophos five years before its IPO in 2015, had owned around 60pc of the company. It announced its intention to sell 51 meters shares, together with its subsidiary Pentagon Lock, after markets closed on Monday. Analysts at Jeffrey's upgraded insulation and roofing supplier SIG to buy from hold.
the move was enough to send shares soaring 4.8%, or 7.9p, to 172.4p rating upgrades from OPS and Investec also helped move healthcare provider Mediclinic out of the FTSE 100 drop zone. Up said the market had overreacted to the firm's Swiss and UAE margins, and the half-year could bring an earnings surprise, while Investec said Mediclinic is through the worst, and it expects to see a significant improvement in operational performance across all platforms.